In this video, we're going to show you how to set up Zoom for video conference with Pengo HDMI to USB-C 4K grabber. Make sure you have the right product. HDMI to USB-C 4K grabber. This one is black. If you're not sure, please find our other video explaining the difference between an adapter and grabber. Link in the description below. We assume that you already connected the device which you want to output images using Pengo 4K grabber. If you're using an older MacBook, use this adapter provided in the package to plug in. If the computer failed to detect, try the other side. There's a fixed direction from USB-C to Type-A. Otherwise, connect the grabber directly to your MacBook through USB-C. First and foremost, verify your computer detected the Pengo device properly before turning on any capture software. This is very important. If you haven't, please check this tutorial video before continuing. Link is in the description below. Before you open Zoom, make sure you allow Zoom to access the microphone and camera. Find Apple menu on the top left of your screen. Go to System Preferences, click Security and Privacy, and under Privacy section, click Camera on the left-hand column and check the box to allow access. Do the same process with microphone. Make sure you only have one capture software running on your computer meaning do not have OBS or VLC or other video softwares running at the same time. Now you need to open Zoom. You should be able to see the video on your screen. Make sure to set up Zoom's audio and video. To do this, go to the bottom of the screen, click the menu next to the headphones, select audio settings, go to the microphone and select Tango 4K grabber. Then select the video and make sure the camera is on the Pengo 4K grabber. Notice that you won't be able to hear the sound from the video you want to share, but your audience will hear the sound when you go live from what Pengo device is capturing. Depending on what you have plugged into the Pengo, you might see your screen to be like a mirror. It's normal. Your audience will see the video in the correct way. Another important thing that you need to know is you won't be able to let the audiences hear the sound from the capture device and you talking at the same time. It's either or. If you want to speak using the computer's microphone, you need to change the microphone sound settings. You need to switch to built-in mic. You can find the settings next to the mic image at the bottom, under audio. Zoom allows you to change settings in the middle of a session. It also allows you to change camera settings. It all depends on the app's design. Pretty cool! Enjoy your live streaming or video conferencing with Zoom. Subscribe if you like our videos. We will upload tutorial, new product releases, FAQs, as well as some troubleshooting videos from time to time. Thank you for supporting us. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to email us.